So today we're going to be looking at some of the best checking accounts that you can have right now. And the first one we're going to have on this list is going to be with Capital One. I actually personally use this on a regular basis all the time and I've absolutely loved it. Very simple and easy to use. Not only do they have the checking, but they do have the savings and it is actually in my top of the savings account list as well too. And you have a lot of other accounts such as uh, teen accounts, even kids savings accounts as well. There are absolutely no fees. I have never paid a fee since having this account before. Uh, there are over 70,000 ATMs as well as being able to deposit money into some of these ATMs. And there are also some cafes, I believe mostly on the East Coast as East Coast as of this recording. And then their mobile services are awesome. I love their online mobile app. I think it works functionally really well. Um, and it's easy, very, very easy to use, I should say. Now, as we go through this list, I will have a link in the show notes down below for you. So you can go ahead and check out some of these banks. Now, some of those links do help support out the channel to get more free content just like this, but all of them take you directly to the home pages of these banks. Some of them will also give you a bonus. So just make sure you check that out. Next up on this list is going to be with SoFi Money. I also use this bank personally on a regular basis. You can see right there, SoFi Money. They actually have some really great features. It's pretty much all online. You do get a free debit card with it. You can see it right there. That's pretty much what it looks like. Functionally, it's really easy to use. There are no fees. I've never gotten charged fees on this account as well. You could have multiple different savings accounts based off of your needs. And they also have a lot of other features on their app as well too. So if you wanna do investing or if you wanna do loans, they have all of that stuff there for you as well too. So it makes everything work really, really easy. Uh, like I mentioned, I use this all the time as well too. Um, the one really great thing that I like is their interest rate, even though it's kind of low, it actually functions both for the checking and the savings account as well. Now, next up on this list is going to be with CIT Bank. Now with CIT Bank, the great thing is similar to the other account, you can get money earned on your checking account. You do unfortunately need a pretty large balance, but if you also have a checking account, you can earn a good percentage on that account itself which I believe is 0.425 as of this recording. But yeah, right now there are pretty much no ATM fees if you wanna be using that. You get, of course, your debit card. You can transfer money with Zelle, which is so fantastic. I love using Zelle to transfer money back and forth to friends and family members. Uh, you can see here, you can deposit checks, um, and then you also get really good features when it comes to being able to travel as well, so that way you can use it in different locations without having to make those like long phone calls to let them know that you're not gonna be at home home or whatever the case may be. Now, next up is going to actually be also Discover. Now, some people might be surprised, but yes, Discover does have a checking and savings account as well, too. I also have this account as well. I actually have all four of the accounts that we've talked about so far here today. I just used all of them for different uh, purposes. You do get a really cool debit card. It actually does look just like that, at least as of this recording. Uh, the really cool thing is you actually get cash back up to $3,000 for debit card purchases. So it's a reward program for using a debit card, which is really cool. And there are no fees. I haven't had a fee since using this account as well, which is really great. And then, like I mentioned, they also have a savings account, which is also on my top savings account list uh, videos. And that one actually does have a really good savings account and a good rate in comparison to regular banks, not obviously in comparison to investing and some other stuff as well too. But nonetheless, it is a fantastic, fantastic bank account. Now, like I mentioned, I have used and tested all of these different ones out before. So I will have links to them in the show notes down below. So you can check them out, test them out. Like I said, some do support the channel. Some of them actually even give you nice little bonuses while other ones just link you up directly to the home pages of these banks. Now, what I want you to do is after checking those links out, I want you to check on this next video right over here so you can actually keep learning and growing with your financial future. My name is Dennis and I'll see you in this next video.